Hang on, it's in the cow, sir. All right, it's Sunday, we're back out. We're at Weed and Beck again. Took a lot of negotiation this time because of obviously different managers, different owners, but here with the usual crew, we've got Aaron, we've got Nicola, we've got Rob, we've got Glenn, we've got Marie, and Rusty's late. There he is, look. There we go, so I haven't ever done this part of weeding before. This is quite hidden, so, and very weedy, but we've got to give it a go. So, let's see how we get on today. Get in there. I've got a farming magnet before I can get it wet. It is, isn't it? Me too. There we go, so I've got an old square nail. It's not bad for first find. I've got a clip. And a magazine as well. And a magazine. There we go on my first throw. I've got a magazine. There we go. It's not bad for a first throw. Glenn? Glenn? <laughs> Glenn? Yeah? Magazine on my first throw. Really? Already? Yep. First throw. No, handgun. And you can't go anywhere without a scaffold clamp, can you? quite sure what that is but we should keep that give it a bit of clean up see if it's got any writing on it got another old square nail I think I found you yeah hang on it can't be the bucket <laughs> no we've got either side of the handle <laughs> we've got to show that <laughs> right so we found a bucket we've got either side of the handle on it look that's a good way to catch. Oh, that stinks. stinks. Oh. <sighs> Got another square now. Loads of them in there. Oh, 
Well, that's an unusual find. That is an old valve radio. So it's an old communication device or something. But it's so flipping manky. I'm going to try and give it a bit of a clean seat. See, but you can see all the valves in it and everything. I've just found the speaker from the radio as well because it's in exactly the same place. I think I've got one down there. So, yeah. so Aaron has got a wheelbarrow, a fence pin, and a telescopic pole. Is that so you can prod Nicola? We have some more square now, there's plenty of them. And my second clip of the day. Sorry, magazine, I'll get it right. Second magazine. What's happened, Glenn? Are you having Evo trouble again? Yeah, I'm stuck again. You can't blame Marie this time. No, Marie's down there, she's safe this time. But <laughs> Rusty's stuck as well. He's at, he's his Morning, power. Steve. Morning. Oh, there we go. I've even done an intro, three throws and I'm stuck twice. Is that his fault? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wrong stuff now. <laughs> I'm going to go with the girls because they don't get it stuck. Yeah, I've got a random plate with something on it. So what you found, Aaron? Well, it's one of them. It's one of them. That's a little one, that is, isn't it? Yeah, it's for Nicola. It's for Nicola's pistol, his tiny little barrel. So there we go, Aaron found that, the revolver. Let's see if you're focused. And as you can see, still got the bullets in it as well. It's a little five shot one. Brilliant. Look at that. That's a view. Yeah. It's not for poking Nicola. No. <laughs> Aaron's found a poker, which he thought is for poking Nicola, but we think it might be cleaning the barrel out on a rifle. Not 100% sure, but we will look into it. She might be able to hear it. Now, obviously, Rusty's had his mags stuck for quite a while now, and look, Glenn's trying to get to the other side. Look. And there he is over there, look, with his chopper. <laughs> there we go, hang on. Let me zoom in, look. There he is, Mr. Machete, look. Trying to get himself along. You'll see him, he'll appear from the bush. He's in there. There he is, look. There's Glenn with his chopper. You got your chopper out, mate? Huh? You got your chopper out? Yeah. <laughs> Maybe towards the canal that way. <laughs> Glenn's trying to get through. So there we go, look. He's determined to get there. Steve, though. Over here, look. Hang on. Ooh. He's already there. <laughs> but he doesn't realise. <laughs> there we go.
Right, let's get straight. Aaron's just found that. Part of a bolt action rifle, but the bloody thing's huge. And it did have a trigger, but Nigel dropped it because he was jealous. <laughs> I didn't drop it, I just snapped it off. <laughs> but part of a bolt action rifle. That's massive, that is. It's heavy as well. It is, yeah. And I've got a track bolt. Not quite as interesting. So apparently that's a handle off a tripod mount. And then I've got a bit of a, a bipod from a Vickers machine gun as well. Right, there we go. Aaron's got the remains of a Sten gun magazine. It's a bit knackered that, mate. Yeah. And Aaron's got another prodder for Nicola, the shorter one. <laughs> Oh. Brass, brass as well. The ends of brass. So they're obviously not rod rests. No, no, <laughs> right, so we've got some cleaning rods. There we go, they've got brass ends on them. So there we go, it's a pair of them. That's Aaron's one for a change, he's his shorter, and that's my one. Look at them, brilliant. We've got a scaffold clamp as well. Found that. I think it's probably a fixing for a fluorescent light. Nothing really interesting. No, she hasn't. Um, belt riveters. You know, they put in the boat, look, punching holes in the leather and putting the. Oh, yeah. I've got a load of them. And a file. So I've got a file, and I've got a leather punch, and another leather punch, and another one as well, so I've got three of them. They're cool. Look, and they still work. Glenn, got some things for you to clean up. They're still working. Got three pet. No, they're bullet. Bullet. Oh, yeah, they're good back to that. You know, have a look. Oh. So Aaron's got that off a Lee Enfield rifle. It goes on the front of the barrel for the shoulder strap. Aaron's got that. It's come off a rifle. It's for the front end of a rifle to put the shoulder strap. <laughs> and I found a bit of box action. So Aaron's got a double-ended nail. Should ask Nicola about that. Apparently she's into double-ended. He's got a, he's got a nine mil. Keeps dropping it, but that's a nice shiny one. Nice little nine mil.
Well, that's more like it. One pull, six magazines, and a stock. <laughs> Rusty down there. Yeah. There you go. That's good. All on one pull. Christ. Oh, yeah. that's, no, no, uh, that's two more. Seven. Seven magazines on one pull. They're in a magazine. They're all yeah, stuck, they're together. All stuck together. Oh, yeah, yeah. You have know, mega in them parts. Seven. And that on the same pull. Uh, same as I got last time. Last time. <laughs> <laughs> That's oh, what yeah. you call a pull. <laughs> that is a good pull. That's definitely part of a good night, all that. Yeah, all on the same pull. Is that just the other side? Yeah, in the weed. So what are they? They're um, stem ones, I think. Yeah, they are. <laughs> Perished. Well, that one in my garage was like that last night. I just tapped it and it's like new now. Is it? Yeah, but it's been in there since last March. So it proper dried out. <laughs> yeah. So it weren't going the best. Then I've just had a really good pull. I've got a sterling stock. There we go. Look, I had last time. So... And seven Stenger magazines all on the same pull. Yeah. Look at that. That's more like it. What a find! Brilliant! That's more like it, isn't it? Incredible, isn't it? I'm going back in the weed. <laughs> oh. I've got the gun now. Look. Oh my oh. god! <laughs> oh. Rick. Rob, get up here! <laughs> I've got the rest of it, yeah. Oh! <laughs> That's what the stock goes on. Yeah. I've got the rest of it. And another three magazines. No way. <sighs> <laughs> that is a sting gun. Yes! So now... Oh, all I'm going to do is put the end on mine. Yeah, put the end on yours. So I'm, I'm sure it's nice to give this to you. Uh, <laughs> so really, uh, oh, is that a, okay, nice. got the magazine. Well, you just give me his word. <laughs> Rusty! I heard, I heard Nigel say you could have that. Mine's been right Nigel. Did but you? But <laughs> I remember Glenn <laughs> saying he doesn't want any more guns. <laughs> that would be all right. I'll get him yes. out of that. That is a World War II door handle. <laughs> 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 that is off a gun as well. And that is the sten. Yeah. Just, 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 just for those who Are don't know, the sten. Over there. Oh, bloody hell. Look at that. <laughs> Steve, this is a find of the lifetime, this one. Only goes back to there on a sten. And, and ten magazines. On the latest sterling yeah, one. Ten well, magazines. Bring your book down, wash it up. Yeah, please, mate. Oh, yes. Watch your fingers. Jesus Christ, you're magnet. I know, I've felt it. I've got ten of them now. Magnet. See if it works. Oh, you've got another two stuck together. I've got it? seven more down there. Oh, look at that. And six on watch finger. Oh. Twice I've warned you, I'm not going to do it again. <laughs> He's <laughs> overexcited. Oh, yeah. Like a three year old dog with two tails. See the film for Wild Geese. So <laughs> I'm about to get the sack. Wait, no, giving it to me, you know, it's because. No, because you're not allowed to. I've got them. the end, I've got the other end to it. <laughs> oh, Jesus, that's a complete one. I've got the stock down there, Port. I just found that, and seven more magazines as well. <laughs> <laughs> Ten magazines. We need to be getting in these weeds, don't we? No, Joel's going to give me that. So I'm going to attach to my end to the end of it, so it's a full one. He's a lovely brown, no, Joel. Please turn that off, yeah. <laughs> Get out of here! <laughs> it's, it's, it's still classed as a full fire arm, that. Suddenly oh, I'm a bit... Look at that! Oh, I'm a bit... You can get me stock. <laughs> well, I would suggest... If yeah, you get his stock, not my stock. I uh -huh. probably don't even need to say this, man. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Exactly. yeah. There were ten magazines as well from the same place. They're going all jealous, too. Yeah, I know, yeah. Sending the copies. You'll feel the way, do you? I know, they're heavy. Look at that. You'll stop, you'll stop shooting that. That's what I mean. He's a lovely brown boy. <laughs> and it looks like it's in one piece.
piece as well. Yeah. It is. I thought initially that was a hole, but that's the end of the cocking. Yeah. Oh, it is, yeah. That's what I mean, the police will take the state There we go. That's it, there you go, you got the complete one. Other way up. That's it. Yeah, that slot just slides on there, doesn't it? Yeah. And that right. would be spring loaded. Not a complete one. Cleaning them, they just fell apart, didn't they? Yeah. Trouble being left-handed, isn't it? They're made for right-handed people. They are. They're no good for me. I'm left-handed. Oh, I can't believe it. One gun I've always wanted. Finally, I've got a machine gun. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's a bucket list, isn't it? You didn't get ten magazines for yours, did you? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and he didn't have. <laughs> the thing is, that's classed as a complete one. Yeah. It's have to be turned in. Yeah, keep, keep that. Uh, keep it all out. Oh, Jesus. Beautiful. Have a look at this. That is awesome. Yeah, don't rush. I'm not too excited. <laughs> You've got some of a party as well, you know. If yeah. Just, uh, just right. wash off. That's just. No, I'm pretty you know sure. You've got that, don't you? That's a short one. It is a short one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It could be actually. It actually, is. it is. Yeah. It's got it the is. same fittings. It, it is. is. Yeah. It's a short one. <laughs> Both going to wash off it. Oh, yes. Yeah. 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 Beautiful, isn't it? It is. No good <laughs> oh, get up here! <laughs> I've always been so pleased for you when you find something good, but in jealous. <laughs> <laughs> Do I have both handles as well, though? It's the one gun I've always wanted and all. I can't, um, ten magazines in two balls, that's a no. feat on its own, isn't it? Yeah. He was just complaining as I walked past you and all. She says, it'll get better. Oh, I didn't find you nothing else. It'll get that short handle as well. They're rare and handle. Hand it in with them. These are common. Yeah, but not them. Not them little stubbies. That's me, but there's some look there, nice. What the stubby? Oh, that is awesome. Some bloody good nick as well. No, look. I wouldn't be at all surprised if you could get that fire in the end of the tree. It's made up of nothing, it's then. You can actually get that to attach. Would that be spring loaded? It would, wouldn't it? Surely to get yeah. that on, that's got to be spring loaded, hasn't it? Yeah. That's what I do. Yeah. Yeah. That's what I'd like to buy. To buy a decommissioned one. To buy a decommissioned one, you're looking at 900 quid to 1200 quid. All right, let's get me other magazines, put them with it, and I'll get a nice picture of it. Oh, oh, God. Who cares? I found a machine gun. <laughs> that is crazy for a full one to be in, though. It is, isn't it? Let me have a trial where I found it, because I ain't told these lot. Out there, that's where it was. Because the magazines come first, and went again. Had another clunk, and I thought. Oh, it's in the cow, sir. Another one. Another one. On your. Place <laughs> you've got another one. <laughs> Hang on. Hang on. <laughs> That's three. <laughs> oh, look. Get out of my spot. <laughs> Oh, That's not fair, Glenn. <laughs> oh, I wish I had. Hang on, there's more. 
Yeah. <laughs> That's four. And a stock. No. <laughs> oh, and all I've got is a bloody roll winding. Look. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Hang on, there's more. <laughs> I bet you there's a there. Oh my god. Holy <laughs> shit. Oh my <laughs> Magazines. <laughs> Glenn, get out. <laughs> So, just because I'll get the fawn of the century, Glenn has to dive in. Come on, feel sorry for me now, Joe. No, <laughs> get out. Feel <laughs> sorry for me. You can have one. <laughs> Hang on, there's more. Oh, uh, yeah, I've got to go live stream. Not tell people, but... <laughs> Will you get out of my bloody fishing bay? <laughs> you know what? No, you're better. You're thinking uh, it's what oh, the box I'm going round there. You yeah, see? <laughs> <laughs> it's in me bay. <laughs> Hang on, there's any cows. There's more. Yeah, there is. Go on, you get yours out first. Oh! <laughs> hey! <laughs> oh, hang on, got more. Come on, Nigel Pig, the piggy dipper. Oh, look. <laughs> For the pride oh, of the piggy dipper. Oh, God. <laughs> That's five. Is it five? Damn. No, I haven't got one. Another one. How can I hump right across that and not get a damn thing? I don't know, but stay away. <laughs> it's my spot. We love you, Nigel. As much as you do, I'm pulling them for my video. Oh no, my head cam's not working. My battery's flat. On the video, you don't want any more. vultures, aren't they? Eh? <laughs> <Don't>. <laughs> I haven't pulled one up yet. I'm standing right next to it. <laughs> Live on YouTube, absolutely nothing to see here. I won't get much with the vultures here. Eh? <laughs> <laughs> well, the lioness gets the uh, the kill, and then all the lions saunter along, don't they, and eat up the carcass. <laughs> Look. Oh, come on, no, I've been magnets for three. Oh, dear. I'm shot top now. What a bunch of vultures. We've just gone straight across there and not got one. Sorry mate, I'm doing my best. I've got some sort of... Uh, some, some sort of... Uh, <laughs> some sort of... 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 Some sort Is that where you are, lad? A little 
<laughs> They're vultures, just because I'm on a good spot. You want to see them? There's magnets flying everywhere. <laughs> I don't want to lower the camera. I don't want to show everything. No, no, no. This is definitely going to be my video. This is going to be the best video. And as you can see, guys, from the backdrop, we are back in the One, two, three, six, four, six, six. <laughs> six. <laughs> yeah, I've counted that one. Yeah, I've counted that one as well. I'm them in a pile over here, but are you sorting them out into different bits? I'm just putting them, counting up what you've got. <laughs> Obviously not. <laughs> Well, not very well if we did. That's all your mags. Yeah, look, they're all them. <laughs> Gonna start a war. <laughs> so, talk about best find ever. Look at that. Look at that. A machine gun, but not only that, it gets better. Look at this. I've got six of them because there's no point in just getting one when you can have six. So that's six complete machine guns with the stocks, with the short stocks as well. And I've got a few magazines, like probably about 30 of them, but I would say that's one crate of them. But look at that six complete machine guns. Look at that smile. <laughs> <laughs> Look, that's beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. And to find six of them is amazing. Number one find of all time. I think so. Yes, definitely. So, if you've had one machine gun, you know how excited you are. But, but to get six, I mean, this is just ludicrous. Uh, Trouble is, I didn't think I'm left handed, and these are all right handed flipping guns, aren't they? God, dear. But. There we go. Best find ever magnet fishing, in my opinion. Leave it in the comments if you think not. We're all slightly jealous. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm going to run a few again because I'm still a bit excited, as you can see. There we go. Complete with the stock. There we go. And. Six short stocks, main guns, so many magazines as well. Look at that. We're quite close to Daventry, aren't we? Yeah, local reporter for the Chronicle, Daventry. All oh, right, okay. There we go, and there's all the stocks. So, that I'm assuming because there was wood in the area as well, that that all those come out of the same crate. <laughs> So that's six machine guns out of the same case. All time, ultimate find. Beautiful. Lovely. Hello. Hello, who's this one speaking to, please? Right, that's it, we're all here. Mine's all twisted. <laughs> <laughs> Do us a favour, turn my camera around, everyone stand oh. facing my camera. Oh. Come on, <laughs> Murray, Murray, step back. Oh, look, I'll be in this one as well. Yeah. <laughs> Go on, I'll get down at the front. Oh, that's sweet. <laughs> <laughs> we all in? Yeah, you're all in. If you're in trouble, no one else can help. Maybe you can ask the outcast. <laughs> And there we go, we got one each. <laughs> Beautiful. Fabulous. <laughs> <laughs> well, let's line them back up for when Count he gets here. Count them back then. in, Nigel, because yeah. you know what these are like. Line them back up properly. <laughs> no trouble. <laughs> <laughs> so that pile there that Steve's still dribbling over. <laughs> We've just had a guy down from the museum and he's trying to get in touch with the other guy now so we can get these preserved, get them in the museum so people can enjoy them, you know, future generations because it's not no good chopping them up, but that's what will happen 
but the guy at the museum is pretty confident that they'll be good to keep them they've just got to find the other bloke so as soon as he comes back we'll get it on film and you can see them sure it's, it's it could be stand but it's got something wrote on it Who took your oil? Yes. The stand, Mark Two. Oh. There's your keepsake. Yeah, your garden. Your keepsake. What's varnishing? Look. Yeah. Yeah, you have. Oh. I'm keeping that. Yeah, it was a whole crate of them. I remember. Yeah. Right, so we're just heading down to the museum because we're going to have a look at the Vickers machine gun that Glenn donated. The lady's going to open it up for us to have a look, so we're just heading down there now. Yeah. And just here, just before Dodford, there's that track there's going down. There's stuff that was pulled out by Suggs when they did the dig okay, at the top of the place. Like As you see, yeah, yeah. Got Lee Enfield magazines, well. Sten SMG, Bremen and Rail magazine adapters, Stenger yeah. magazine. They, the You've seen a few of them on my video already. Yeah, we we and the bits for Vickers. So, yeah, this is downstairs. Anne Marie. They were told that they weren't allowed to knock them down. Yeah. One night in the early 70s. All Apparently this is the royal fire. corner. Oh. And they, because the a lot of royals have visited the, the, the depot. The in the village is that they were built for the king to live in should Napoleon invade. So because Napoleon didn't invade, he didn't invade there. See, I've heard different to that then. So I'm just a boy that is here on the Churchill's family was there. Churchill came here, yes he did. Uh, right, okay. Somebody said they were, they were going to hide him up the top there, there was a place if need be. Right, to hide him. Mm. Mm. There is a lot were. to this place that I don't know. Because it was so far inland they said that they probably wouldn't suspect him to be hiding there. Yeah, mm. which is probably right because in the Second World War they, they never bombed this place. They, they dropped some bombs in a field outside of this place on the way back from Coventry yeah. Yeah. and they shot, shot a gun there we go. shooting there's an aerial there. view in 1983. They were getting rid of their ammunition from Coventry. They didn't realise what yeah. this was. I don't know why they did. I, Church, I thought um, Hitler had a maps of everywhere in yeah. the world. Yeah, you know, you'd afford to just vote. Okay. Yeah, it targeted it. There's a site plan. One, you'd have thought, if I was it there, I'd have been like, we've got to get that because it's a main supplier, isn't it? It's main. Right. And of course, I think when you're flying up there, it's sort okay. of hidden in a way. And there's the site plan, 1803. I'll tell you another story as well. Over there, where the, where the canal yeah. used to be, that's now a road, yeah. they had Nissan huts. And they. There we go, we have a Lee Enfield rifle, look. Yeah, that would be for the... And there's some of the bits, one of those there, that Aaron found earlier. Now, I was given that box uh, two or three weeks before mm. Christmas. That That's box a very nice was one. built here in the carpentry, in the carpentry oh, shop wow. by this chap's father. And it's come back? And it's come back made. to the depot. So I would like to get some, whether they're polystyrene, cardboard, whatever, guns in there to represent yeah. them. Yeah. I don't want anything that's worth anything because I don't want people to pinch them. We're yeah. having to uh, hide all the guns in here. Oh, I can imagine. Yeah, you get all kinds of things. They're trying to... There it is. Now, that young lad you just see, yeah. he's our gun expert, and he wrote this book. He's numbered each article on there, oh, and he's wow. put a number in the book telling people all about all it because he knows all about the guns. He's really good. There's your Liam Phil. Oh, right, the more Enfields, one, two Enfields. Right. That could be the... That's a musket. That's a musket. So is that the Enfield? Yeah, that's got a long bit on it, that one. Yeah, that's probably what that one is up for then. Yeah. So whatever date that would be there, yeah. should tie Those it. Those buttons like and badges. Because yeah. I think, what happened after we found the bottle? You found the bottle off the end of that? Really? Oh, right, it's a cat. 
Brilliant. Well, that could be good. That, yeah, that would be good. Okay. Yeah. It's not as bad, it's like. It is nice, isn't it? Or should I leave that in there? Um, over there is your fitness. Oh, I've been there. Oh, there's your fitness. Yeah. Yeah. Action oh, fitness. Look at that. Oh, that's oh, nice. Oh, oh, yeah. Do you know, Doreen, can I be cheeky? Yeah. 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 And there's Rusty's Vickers gun. They gave to Glenn and Glenn donated it. Look at that pride of place in the cabinet. And she's going to put Yeah, and we're going to have a photo of a slot in there as well. But after today, they've got so much more. I think they're going to need a bit more storage space. But really good. And here's the museum part for the fire station. Okay. The uniforms, another one in there. Ah, oh, that's one shiny axe, that is, look. Hard to get with the lights, but... As you see, definitely worth a visit. If you're into your history, I would definitely get yourself here and have a look round. Brilliant place. I've been nosy already, sorry. Yeah, that's right. Let's take you in the other room. Okay. There we go. You can see that everything's been loaded on the trolley now. And these will be taken down to the museum. This is the chap from the museum. And Steve's just loading them all up. Ready to go. It's an unusual looking trolley, Steve. We've never had a fine like this here. Haven't they? That's good. This is the biggest collection we've had. Excellent news. Sorry, Steve, I'm too busy to help you. Best final. I've got a pig stick bay in it for you as well, which we got out last time we was here. Yeah. Yeah, so I'll go and grab that for you. Oh, well, nice. Uh, yeah, uh, last time we was here, there's a few things we've got that we've cleaned up and brought back mm. to go in the museum, but I've got a pig stick bay in it with the sheath as well. Yes, well, I mean, I'm sure we would be more than happy to well, agree to you cleaning up some of the items and bringing them back. If yeah, I don't want to take them on, though. <laughs> <laughs> in other words, you don't want to do them. <laughs> yes, yeah, so. well, it would... Uh, Definitely a lot of work, but <laughs> oh God, yeah, yes. but fine like that. I mean, well, it's a lot of electrolysis, I should imagine. Yeah, amongst other things. Right, say goodbye to them. <sighs> Best Bye. find ever. Look, and they're going, going down to the museum. But I don't care because I found them and I got my picture. It's good news. And this chap here, we'll put him in the museum, and that's what it's all about: it preserving history. Definitely. And they're not going to get chopped up. Fantastic news. Crack it. He's crying. <laughs> and there they were. Gone. Just like children. Yeah. Not to 18, they're gone. They're gone, look. <laughs> hey? It's the biggest donation they've ever had. Yes! It's the biggest finds they've ever had on this site. Yeah, because they dug up in acres and didn't find that. When they were here with the TV crew. Yeah, Right, so there we go. That's all our donations there today. As you can see, it's still a bit wet. You can see there's the crate there from the Sten guns. It's actually got Sten Mark II on the side. There's finds from last time we was here. So for all you Deltas, we have brought them back. Yeah. You know, it's, it's took time, but it's been a while getting here. But they're all here, and what a blooming good day. Yes, proper history preserved. That's it. Or all handed over and in yeah. its rightful place. Thank you. <laughs> Yeah, well, that was good. Oh. So I just kicked it off here. Yeah. Oh, I've shown that. Then... So, we've got a bracket. We've got a roller bearing. A Viador battery. Bit of cast iron. This weird thing that we haven't actually got a clue what that is. But you've got one. I've got one, yeah. It's a very big tent peg. <laughs> Aaron found an old bike bell. Not much of that left, but. 
and a tap head, just seem to remember last time we got loads of them from here. We've got an oop. I've got an ammo crate latch. I've got a corner off an ammo crate. Oh, hang on, focus. Thank you. What you got, Aaron? A knife. He's got a knife, look. It's a rusty knife, that is, look. And just for a change. Oh, that makes change. <laughs> Don't see many of them. <laughs> yeah, it's a, you're right, it's off a Bren gun. <laughs> I've got a rivet. Big rivet, look. And I've got this that looks like a really dodgy CV joint, but I don't think it is. Not quite sure what it is. I won't hit it just in case. But then Aaron went and found something that looks similar. Yeah, we got that. And a bit of plate. And one of them. It's like a cap for something. Not sure what though. Now that's to do with a gun. Part something. We've, we did find them before, but we don't know what it is. Um, Bit of tubing. Oh, there we go. Oh, gold seal. Yeah, that's a old Ever one. ready gold seal. And a rechargeable. And a rechargeable battery. Look, there we go. What else you got, Aaron? I got a spark plug. <laughs> Why can't you go anywhere without a spark oh. plug? <laughs> <laughs> got a, uh, a, pole. a bit of pole. I've got a funny bit of flat metal with a sharp end. Yeah, murder weapon. Track bolt. <laughs> Track bolt. <laughs> And a funny thing, a knobbly lump something. Yeah. Don't know what that is. And he's got a bit off my noose. I didn't show me noose. I oh, know. I'll get that in a second. It's just down there. And I got. And he got an anti-tamper bolt. bolt. Yeah. And I got a pipe corner. A square washer. A square washer. And this, this I found this earlier. I've got to show you this. Um, I got a noose. Well, it's, man's noose. it's a big toe strap, but it, it broke. So whatever they were towing. Ain't too much of Christmas. So there we go. That's another pile of bits. So we'll clear that up and we're going to move up the top. Right, also, it's got a handle off an ammo crate. So we can do it. No, it's not though. Oh, is it not? That's not... Well, might be, yeah, it's got, got screw holes there, yeah, yeah it is. I just uh, stopped and picked up what was on the way down here. Yeah, it's the rusty stuff. Oh, OK, I didn't There we go, there. so we've got a bit of conduit. We'll just add to that. Yeah, and do it afterwards. A bit of chain. So, Aaron's on the blades. He's got two Stanley blades, or was it three? Three Stanley blades. And a razor blade on the same pole. Yeah, <laughs> Aaron's got some more Stanley blades. It's, just, it's a weird ball. Aaron's just come down and put a weird ball in my hand. It's like a bearing, but it's hollow. But it's chromed. I don't know, some sort of ball. We've got an old door, an old drawer handle, with a bit of string wrapped around it. <laughs> so Aaron's on more blades. Another four. Another four. Yeah, that in there. Yep. It's just swelled out at the bottom, hasn't it? Yeah, I'm going to say, it ain't going to go through the ball very well. No. So Aaron's just found an old piston. See the gudgeon pin sticking out the side? Got the rings, the alley has badly deteriorated, but a piston. Well, I wasn't expecting to find one of them here, but I've got a shotgun shell. He's spent. He's empty. I'm just a bit of rod. Hold on, I'm one more Stanley blade. <laughs> Another blade. Nobody showed this down there, so I've got a wheel brace. There we go, so Aaron's got a large wheel brace. So I've got a spike, an old bit of drain pipe. There are four more Stanley blades. Blades! Can we see you there? Because it is getting a bit dark now. Yeah, we can sort of see them. Yep. I don't know how many that is in total. You have to when you <laughs> right, okay. So I've just found that, which apparently is a muzzle breech off a Vickers machine gun. No, off a Bren. Bren. Okay, I'll shut up. I've just found that, and that's off a Bren machine gun. It's the muzzle breech. So we'll be keeping that and getting that cleaned up. 
I might be going back to the museum, but while Rust is here with his light, because it is a little bit dark, all I'm going to say is I'm going to do my outro now. I know the others down there. It's been an absolutely amazing day. Them guns, six blooming Sten guns in the same place. Unbelievable. 40 odd magazines, all complete. But yeah, I've got to admit, I was getting a little bit disappointed by lunchtime because not much was coming out. And to find all that within like two or three minutes was unbelievable. But anyway, check out the others' videos. We've got Rusty Nuts there. We've got Peaky Dippers down there. We've got Dudley Dippers. But all I can say is from Weed and Beck, you didn't disappoint them. That elf, you're bloody staying, you are. That's five <laughs> weeks running now. But amazing time, amazing video. And all them guns are back in the museum where they need to be so you can all enjoy them. So get your butts over it and have a look. Thanks for joining and we'll catch you Friday.